Assalamu alaikum brothers and sisters and non Muslim YouTubers. This is another uh, Adobe After Effects tutorial. This tutorial will be going through the basic tools. Um, I posted a video on uh, some five second uh, m uh, mini clip of some text flying. And I, was, I said that I'll do that. Yes, I will. It's just that my last tutorial was about the rotation tool and uh, basically. Um, I didn't really notice that the audio was so bad, it sounded like I was doing it in the toilet or something like that. Uh, not in the toilet, in the bath, so there's more like echo sound or whatever. Uh, yeah, so I apologised for that, and there were some people rating it for some reason. <laughs> okay, so yeah, I'll be going through the rotation thing again, and plus I'll be going through other tools, and then we're going to be looking at something like this. Day. So this is really easy and basic, and uh, I'll go through it step by step. Okay. Now, uh, you want to press. Uh, let me just delete this. Insert new text. Type tool. And you go name anything you want. Drag it to the middle, and well, I have to drag it to the side because I think I'll be using the rotate. Well, I'll change it in a second. Okay. Um, now what I want to do is click on layer and click on. Um, first thing I'll be starting today is uh, the scale. This is the scale tool. You press S, and you click the time, and it decreases. That actually change decreases and increases. So I'll be going like this. Let me just make that stand out. Yeah, so this is the scale. It's really basic. Just what it does, it just uh, enlarges your uh, image, your text, anything like that. So you add the first frame, put, make sure you put, click the time. If you don't click the time, it's not gonna, nothing's going to work for you. Then you increase it. This will make it go, will make it expand. This will make it more larger. So, yeah. But if you want to join them together, you just pl click this thing there, that thing there, sorry. And uh, yeah, so it will make it. Like it's flowing out or something like that. Yeah, so that's the scale. This is the scale. You press S for this uh, thing, or you can go through here and you go to transformation and then you click scale. Okay, so we want to turn that off before we can go to other effect. Uh, actually, let's just go through here so it could be manually and uh, easy to use. Okay, we're going to use the rotation. Okay, uh, the rotation tool is really, really useful. I'll be uh, click on this tool here, and you wanna wait. Let me see. Yeah, so that's. That's how it is. You see this little anchor point here? It actually rotates around it. As you can see, there, that little aiming thing. It turns up uh, the value. No, I don't need a value. Oh, what's happening? Yeah, that, I just increased the size. I want to decrease it because it's going around too fast. Yeah, this is really uh, a, a basic tool, and I'm really, really sorry for the last tutorial. Like, really, really <laughs> useless. So, uh, uh, some people may think, "Oh, this is useless," but if you want to make some uh, animated logo, you put a little square, new shape, and stuff like that. 
then you want to make it like little uh, some nice and uh, yeah so that's it let me let's just do everything together I'm gonna change my text and delete it because uh, some people are like delete it man what's wrong with you going through the hard way um what should I call it cats and dogs um actually this is actually a you know, like a little quote my little so yeah, let me just uh, let's just delete that for now. Just increase it. I'll change my color white. Okay, first thing I want to apply the opacity. Um, opacity. Let me just go. You press T for opacity. Um, I'm just going to decrease it. Then here, I'm just going to decrease it. Now what I'm going to do is add the position. Press P for position. Add uh, position, and uh, move out, move down. There's something actually useful here, but let me just. Uh, right click on frame. Frame, go frame assistant. Actually, I'll explain it in the, some uh, other tutorials about this. It just makes the the text go really fast. Uh, uh, yeah. Uh, so when we move it around, it'll go a bit faster. Sometimes it'll, it'll go slow. And yeah. Uh, now we want to use scale. Okay, now uh, hmm. let me let me play, let me just what's this uh, position position and just move it, move it back again and then just apply the scale and make it big. Big. So let's play this little clip by pressing spacebar. Yeah, let's add a bit of rotation. Okay. Uh, press uh, R and uh, let's clip of rotation. Yeah, I'll put some rotation there. Click on the time. And yeah, that's it. That's. Well, I didn't make it spin. Okay, let's just uh, increase. Let's go here. Make some spins. Spin. I wonder why it's not spinning. Oh, stupid me. Okay, so yeah, so that's it. Cats and dogs, and um, because uh, I'm going to do two tutorials today, there's going to be like. Uh, Addition, uh, additional one, and uh, I'll be making this one tutorial, and I'll go through it step by step. Uh, I really love this uh, text, and uh, actually, you find it uh, if you go to the first video. I, I put this challenge for you lot. Um, this this video, which was made by After Effects, I found out that they just used this this way at the end of the video of naming all the uh, heroes and uh, yeah so it's uh, interesting I was wondering how they did it um, all right this that's it for this tutorial whoa I think I passed 10 minutes all right salam alaikum brothers and sisters I hope you all find this beneficial and I, I, I really apologize for what I did last tutorial it was really really 
Um, rubbish. Uh, yeah, that's just one word to describe it. Rubbish. Okay, I'm really sorry for that. And please subscribe to my channel for more updates. And uh, yeah, alright, Sam Alaikum.